I am not here to talk about 5th, 6th or 7th generation of fighter jets, let's go further and talk about 8th generation, subscribe if you want to get on this plane, let's go then. I could imagine it to be a combination of the some pretty 8th generation characteristics. Number 1, unmanned UCAV with the option of a cockpit. Number 2, it will be super stealthy and have a high survivability threshold under any situation and can be deployed anywhere on earth, in snow or desert. Number 3, possess noise cancellation technology. Number 4, easily transition from subsonic to hypersonic speed with super cruise capability. Number 5, zero refueling for months if not for years as it can have nuclear fuel powered engines, nanonuclear reactors is research in progress. Number 6, carry unconventional weapons like EPBM, electronic particle beam weapons, or even scalar weapons. Number 7, next-gen advanced communication and radar system for network-centric warfare including space-based BMC-3. Number 8, easy maintenance and repair capability having smart materials with self-healing slash correcting metallurgical properties. Number 9, hybrid VTOL variant with amphibious capabilities also operating in underwater compatible mode in case of deep ocean strike rolls. Number 10, suitable for semi-LEO, low Earth orbit, air combat deployed under the Space Command Unit of the Air Force. Number 11, it should be unmanned means no pilots. Number 12, the aircraft will have the ability to be broken down and fly as a drone as necessary self-sustaining battery units, and rejoin later if the situation demands. Number 13, the aircraft should be solar powered. Not by petroleum-based fuels. Number 14, the fighter jet should have mini-autorized firepower. Super high density explosives. Number 15, eighth generation fighter should have dual engines, one for space level travel means cryogenic, other for atmospheric travel which is turbine engines. If necessary the aircraft should fly to space, break down, come to to the earth and rejoin again to attack targets. Number 16, it should have ability to create force fields which can block bullets and possibly some basic missiles. Which is truly futuristic. Number 17, the plane should have a shell which can create vacuum in the innermost region between plane and shell. This will help for faster speeds and even protection also, if necessary. We are about to land, who landed successfully. If you want to know about Russia-Ukraine war, sanction on Russia, click on the left side of your screen.